guys. Ugh, man, this is one I've actually been waiting for for quite a while. Um, I got a package from Australia, from King Roy. Uh, Jennifer Bailden um, sent me a bunch of things. I mean, little snacks and fun things, whatever. And so cool. I appreciate it. Seriously awesome. A um, couple of things in here. Like I said, we've got uh, pork jerky. Awesome. A couple of these little bars, these nougat bars. I said, I actually never had any food from Australia, so this is really cool. Um, burger rings. I've got angry taco peanuts and other peanuts here, lime ones. Um, some stuff you mix in milk. Pretty cool. A cute, amazing little dude here. But here's a. <laughs> I've never had Vegemite. Oh my god! This is great! <laughs> I've heard horrible things and great things about this. So I'm actually really excited to see what these taste this tastes like because I've heard horror stories and I've heard good. So I came prepared with some bread, just in case. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to eat it all because I've I don't even know what this is. This is awesome. She actually even sent me instructions on how to eat it, which is so cool. And I'm like So honestly, I'm just going to be trying some of these foods here. This is great, like I said, but when it comes down to the very end, that's when the challenge for the Vegemite begins. So I just want to eat this stuff and see what it's about. And like I said, totally appreciate this. Jennifer, you freaking rock. This is awesome. Like I said, it's really hard sometimes to get foods in between countries. So it's like if people want to send stuff like that and you get to try things. I've never had a whole bunch of international food, so. Um, you know, eventually your own country's food gets really old. But this is really good. Um, I got this a rice crispy bear. Um, there are some. Obviously, every country has stuff that you would like to either try, not try, whatever. But I've this also sir stroming. I that's on the bucket list. Eventually, I would like to try that. Um, it's really expensive though. I don't know, whatever. But eventually that will be on the list. So, like I said, this is really cool. Just being able to have a little variety pack. A nougat roll with coconut. It's kind of sad because honestly, Australia would have been a great trip to go for this year. But I don't think anybody in America is going anywhere. This is actually really good. I'd say the other stuff, I'm just going to try. Because I'd like my kids to actually have a little bit of it. But what I'm really interested in is this, so. <laughs> That'll work for me. So pork jerky. It looks just exactly like our regular beef jerky, uh, or whatever jerky. It also tastes about the same. It's good though. It's lean pork instead of beef. I actually haven't really seen must any really anything like this per se in America. It's usually turkey, usually beef. Um, I mean, sometimes turkey, but 
Um, you can definitely tell this is pork as opposed to our beef. But, it's really good. It's actually pretty soft. Um, I'm definitely down for uh, any kind of stuff like that. I wouldn't mind drying my own stuff. <laughs> Probably save a lot of money. <laughs> Alright. Okay, so these I would assume are like like funions maybe. That's burger rings, but I'm sure they probably taste like a burger. I'm assuming. Oh wow, they're actually a little really small. Um, check this out here, little babies. They're little babies. Oh my god. Look at exactly like a funion. Only like my, really small. Um, and they taste like a cheeseburger. Those are actually really good. Almost the exact same consistency as the Funyun. Maybe not quite as sharp. But actually, yeah. Yeah. So those are really awesome. Um, I've got... Angry Taco Peanuts. They're here. And this is just, I, this is actually just seriously cool. Like I said, it's, it's so appreciated that, that you actually sent this, Jennifer. Like I said, I just love trying foods from around the world and even snacks. Sometimes going for international snacks. <laughs> uh. Those are spicy. <laughs> oh, those actually have a really good kick to them. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright. I mean, and they do. They look just like a regular peanut. But it's spicy. Oh wow. Well. These are the hanging lime ones. Same brand. Look exactly the same. But I've never had a lime flavored peanut. <laughs> They're good. Ugh. All right, so now I've got two options. I've got the milk stuff and I've got this. I'm gonna get this, because I actually brought some milk in here, although I don't usually put milk in my bedroom. Um, oh gosh, I guess I that. I'll put that up there. This looks kind of like, I would say in here, like Nestle's Quick or I suppose Ovaltine, I guess. Um, here we go. Can you see that in there? All right, I got that. <laughs> here, and I did bring some milk in here just because. And I was like, well, it says to put in here a couple of little teaspoons in here, but I never did teaspoons in my life, so I guess when I was a kid, I kind of just dumped it in. <laughs> and then my mom would get mad because of the, uh, we ate it all, but. Whatever. Hi, Wumpies. Hi, baby. Okay. It's like not sinking to the bottom. Oh. There you go. There. Let's see what I can do with this here. Uh, so, like, it's, it's all stuff on the top. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Alright. So... I'm the mix master. Alright. Eh, eh, eh. Well, it's on top. I was, maybe I should have made it hot. Because it said I can make it hot or cold. 
and it's like 95 degrees out, so I don't really want to do the hot, so. It's grudgy! Oh my god. It tastes like crunchy chocolate milk. <laughs> it's like it didn't dissolve. See it? Here. Look at this. It's not dissolving. It's all on top. <laughs> Anybody crunch? Mmm. It's like Nestle's quick, but it didn't dissolve. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna go heat that up a little bit later, and maybe sip on it a little bit here. Okay, so these are awesome. You have no idea how long I've wanted to try this Vegemite stuff. <laughs> okay, so these are picky, picky peanuts, mighty Aussie nuts. They're my <laughs> mighty Aussie nuts. And they're Vegemite flavored. So, hopefully these are awesome. They look exactly like peanuts. Check that out there. <laughs> uh, they've got like this weird... I don't know what the heck that is. <laughs> it's... It's got an aftertaste. Mm. I don't... Oh. I don't know, maybe it's the peanut. Maybe it's the... I don't... They're good, but des it, it has a very notable taste that you... I don't know. I can't even describe it, it's weird. I don't, I don't know. Probably whatever what's in this, right here, <laughs> is what's gonna tell me how that, well, for the reason for that, what I taste that, I, I just, uh, it's not horrible, it's just weird. So Vegemite for vitality. <sighs> I don't know. I don't even know what the main ingredient is. Concentrated yeast extract. So basically I'm eating yeast extract. Okay, got that, it's sealed with that. Uh, oh God, it's, fuck it's black. I gotta try this. It's, is it, it's, looks like, it's like thick. Look at that. Look at that. Oh gosh. Oh. All right. So. It's definitely what the taste of the nuts is. So I took bread out of the kitchen because I'm eating this whole darn tube. That's my challenge for the day. <laughs> Eating all of the Vegemite. <laughs> mm, I can't wait. So, I've got my Italian bread. Yes. Hopefully, I can make myself a couple Vegemite sandwiches. <laughs> oh my gosh. Alright. Italian bread. Like I said, we're going to put this on nice and thick because... She said less is more, but more could also be less. <laughs> oh God. So I've got this on here. <laughs> oh, it smells horrible. Oh my God. But hopefully it's a good sandwich. That is not a good sandwich. Oh my god. <laughs> this is going to be one of those where I'm going to be chasing it with water. Ugh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Ugh. 
Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, Jennifer, you're right. Less is more. <laughs> oh. Oh, my God. Oh, my. Oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. Oh. <laughs> uh, this is going to be a long sandwich. So, because I'm going to cut my losses, we're going to make this awesome. So, I'm going to probably just make two amazingly big sandwiches. Because I don't know how many these sandwiches I could honestly eat. This is... Oh. Oh, the smell is just. I think it's, if it's a little bit, it's not bad. Oh my gosh. I'm emptying a tube of toothpaste here. There we go. All right, so this is a whole 145 gram <laughs> tube of Vegemite. It is gone. It is. It's it's empty. It's gone. <clears throat> oh gosh. Ugh. And here are what the insides of my sandwiches look like. It's bad. It is not. <laughs> All right, Jennifer, this is for you. This is... Ugh. Thank you so much for the Vegemite. I don't plan on buying any in the future. This is not gonna be on my uh, my wish list. So, cheers, girl. You rock. Thank you, Australia. Oh my God. Ugh. Ugh. I don't have to and taste it and not swallow it whole because oh my god <laughs> oh Oh god. I can see why she wrote to take a quarter to half a teaspoon per piece of bread. Not the whole container. Oh. 
Made for a good challenge though. Oh, wow. This is intense. I cannot even believe how it's like it's a little bit is fine, but to eat this in mass quantities, oh gosh. Got a piece of white bread there. Oh. Oh gosh. Look at this. That is a thick sandwich. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh. Ah. It's like stuck on my tongue. Oh, all right. Oh dear gosh. Where's that crunchy milk at? <laughs> oh my gosh. I just want the taste out of my mouth. Ugh. Oh, gross. <laughs> ah. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Awesomeness. I have fulfilled something I've always wanted to try. I tried Vegemite and I ate the whole container. Jennifer, rock on, thank you. I no longer want to try this again. Probably not even in small quantities. <laughs> I seriously appreciate this. This alone is a challenge in itself for 
145 grams. Wow, that is insane. I could have never imagined something like this would taste like that. Um, with smell, the taste. I mean, seriously glad I got to actually try it. That's really cool. I seriously appreciate you sending this to me all the way up from Australia. And, uh, wow. If you want a real challenge, eat a container of this because I'm telling you right now, this is not a joke. This is, eh. The taste, it's like it doesn't go away, and it's, oh, wow, it's like tar. Oh, my gosh. Uh, maybe in small quantities, I'd say it would probably actually be really good with tomatoes or something like that, but, oh, gosh. This, this right here, this is a challenge. Thanks, girl. I appreciate it. <sighs> wow. Off the bucket list. Hey. So, uh, without anything else really much to say, because I can't, uh, I need to get some more milk. Uh, like and subscribe, folks. Thanks for anything y'all send me. I appreciate all, all y'all, everyone who watches. If you want to send something, let me know. I will definitely try it. I've had some really odd things sent my way, and I'm just like, I don't sure I'll eat it. Why I don't care. I'll eat just about anything. Um, yeah. Have a wonderful day. Thank you again, Jennifer. And we'll see you next time, hopefully with something not like this. <laughs> Catch up.